Oh man, it has been a while since I've sat down in front of a camera. I think the last video I put out, was it Christmas? Christmas Eve or New, no, New Year's Eve, I think was the last video I put out of a climb. This video is, it's a big one. It's a big deal for me. It's a big deal for just my channel in general. A lot has happened over the last six, seven months and things are about to change, like drastically change. I know a lot of you probably won't be too happy about this. So please bear with me. A lot has happened. There was a lot to talk about. I know that a bunch of you have been worried and asking, are you alive? Are you dead? Are you depressed again? Where are you? What's going on? First of all, thank you. I appreciate that you care. I'm not depressed. I've actually been completely fine since I made that video. Like I have bad days here and there, but generally I'm in a good place now. The only issue is with YouTube, which is what this video is about. So where should I start? Right, let's go back to January. I uploaded my last video, New Year's Eve. It was fine, but then sometime in January, it got demonetized. And I thought, okay, this is normal. You know, some of my videos get demonetized, some don't. That's just the way YouTube is. That's just the way things go. If you know YouTube, you know that YouTube's cracking down hard on the content that you can now put on its platform. And I thought, okay, maybe they're just, maybe they're making some changes. Maybe things are going in a direction where my channel doesn't really have much of a future on YouTube just because of the nature of my content, the climbing, the dangerous stuff, breaking in, even though it's not breaking in, the sneaking into private property, stuff like that. You know how it is. And you will actually know that quite a few people have already been shut down and are in much worse positions than I am, to be honest. And that sucks. So January, this video gets demonetized. I think it was in like two, within two days of it going up so I thought okay this is unusual but maybe it's just a blip maybe it's just a one-off and then weeks went by and I was like okay well things are being demonetized more now than ever and what went from being one every few months or six months it was literally one a week and I was like okay this is different like this is something new like maybe they're really really cracking down on videos now and then within 24 hours my whole channel every single video i think it was like 90 something videos demonetized demonetized like every single one gone completely demonetized let me just explain to you what the word demonetized means obviously it means that you can no longer have ads on your videos youtube removes the ads they've decided this video is not ad friendly we can't monetize it that's it you'd think that would be it right and it would just be a case of you're not making any money anymore which is not the end of the world it's a big deal when YouTube is my job and a lot of other people's jobs. Right, let's break down YouTube. YouTube, firstly, is an amazing platform. You can share your creations with the world and you can interact with them and people can comment on it. It's just an amazing platform, it really is. And it has, it's changed so many people's lives because it's let them do what they love for a living. And that is an incredible thing. And I really appreciate YouTube for that because it has changed my life completely. But behind that fundamentally YouTube is a business so they have goals they need to make money that is what businesses do they are built to make money so what I'm trying to get across is that when a video is monetized YouTube promotes it it's on the recommended you know when you watch a video and on the side you've got the list recommended videos watch this up next all that stuff that is basically how my channel and probably most channels get new viewers and get new subscribers people will be watching videos and this one will pop up and say check out james kingston's video blah 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 and they'll come and watch it and then they'll be like oh my god this is i've never seen this guy before i'm going to subscribe that is how most youtubers gain their following and keep growing that's just how it works so when a video is demonetized it takes it off of all of those recommendations your video is basically dead to youtube you cannot find it unless you go to that person's specific channel and find it on there which is it's just not how it works most of my views 90 percent of my views are new viewers that are being pushed to my videos from other people's channels that is partly the beauty of youtube but when your video is demonetized it is gone man it is just dead to the world so what this means is if your channel is getting like i don't know a few hundred subs a day new subs and all your videos are fine you're growing your channel is growing every time you upload a video it is then put out to more people than the last video and that is how youtube works right when all of your videos get demonetized you have no more promotion so nobody finds your channel 
Nobody finds your videos. And I can see this on the back end. So on the back end of YouTube, I can see real time stats. I can see how many people are watching any video at any moment. Every few seconds, it will update and just tell me how many people have watched it in the last few seconds. It's nuts what you can do on the back end of YouTube. But let's take, for example, a video that's getting I don't know, 100 views a minute. It's monetized, it's all completely fine. As soon as that video gets demonetized, the views go from 100 a minute, literally they drop dead. And you're lucky if you get a view every 60 minutes. That is how much of a difference it makes. YouTube promotion is everything. If your videos aren't monetized, they just don't get anywhere. Like you just cannot, you just can't do it. It kills your channel and your channel can be growing like this pretty good and then doof, off. So 24 hours, whole channel gone. I went from gaining a few hundred subs a day to losing a few hundred subs a day. And it's just like, what, what is going on? How? What? Oh, it was so frustrating. So I was like, okay, well, what do I do at this point? So what I did, I tried uploading new videos. I thought, okay, I'll upload something that's like 100% ad friendly, child friendly, totally fine and immediately demonetized. But what you can do is you can appeal it and you can basically say request manual review, which means a human being, a real life breathing human being can watch that video and be like, okay, that is suitable for monetization or that is not suitable, deny it. And that's that. Every single video that I uploaded immediately demonetized. Every single video that I appealed immediately demonetized. You could tell nobody was watching it. It was just getting shut down completely. And then I was like, okay, well, my channel is just, my channel's gone. They've just completely demonetized it. There's nothing, like, there's nothing I can do now. So I got in touch with my YouTube network and thankfully, thank you so much to Zoom in my YouTube network for, for all the help like, over the last six months literally six months man it's taken six months to make some progress they are the only people that can make direct contact with youtube it seems like that anyway like i can't contact anyone and it's just annoying so i, I contacted them i said look this is what's happening can you please contact youtube like a, a network will help you with serious problems on youtube a youtube network a good youtube network should help you fix those problems so they sent off an email to youtube so i'm gonna be honest right it took them a month to reply it took them a month i understand they're a busy company they're a massive company and i can't even imagine can't even begin to imagine how much goes on at youtube but a month is just a long time man and i know i'm not like a huge huge channel that have millions of subscribers but i've got i mean i've got what 630 000, like that's a lot of people man that's a, a lot of people and i just thought it would be a bit quicker you know a month to receive an email so they said tell james to private all of his climbing videos and the youtube robot the YouTube robot might fix his channel. Might. Might fix his channel. Might not. But try it. What kind of response is that, dude? How can you be part of YouTube and say, do this, might work? It just might work. Like, surely YouTube can go on the back end, click a few buttons, and say, this was the problem. Don't do that again. So I, I just wasn't too pleased with that response, really. I expected more help, to be honest. But because I had no choice. I tried it, I made my climbing videos private, and yep, guess what, nothing happened. You know what's funny actually, is all the videos I made private that were the ones that you'd think would be not ad friendly, so the climbing ones, the dangerous videos, some of them actually got re-monetized. And I thought, okay, well this doesn't make sense because these are clearly against YouTube's new guidelines, potentially harmful or dangerous activity. That is the new guideline that is, that is ruining a lot of people's channels. But for some reason, these videos that were very, I mean, dangerous and potentially harmful they were getting re-monetized so i thought okay well i'll just put them public again maybe this is it it's fixed and as soon as i put them public again immediately shut down then i was like look guys this is my whole channel my whole channel has been demonetized anything i put up gets immediately shut down please can you help me and give me like a, an actual solution and this seemed to go back and forward it went back and forward for six months literally six months i would explain the situation in detail they would come back with a single line reply after a few weeks not offering any kind of any progressive information like they, they just didn't offer me anything to help and then finally last week my youtube network had a call an actual phone call with somebody from youtube actually at youtube a real human being and discussed everything finally six months later have the solution what they said was okay james you need to delete 
every single one of your videos that isn't ad friendly and goes against our guidelines so that potentially harmful or dangerous activity thing anything that goes against that you need to delete it not just hide it delete gone off my channel forever so that means the video is gone all the comments are gone all the ratings the views gone and that was a bit of a shock because i was like okay well if this is what i need to do then i'm happy to do it it's just like deleting my whole story you know this whole youtube thing and the climbing has been a massive massive part of my life and just to delete all of those videos is a big thing and it's scary because that is my story that is me like those videos are me so they said james you have to delete all your videos i did that and they said you need to get 400,000 hours of watch time and I was like, why do I need to do that? I can clearly get the views. Like, why would we go back to square one when you can just switch my channel back on and that's it? And that's just the way it is. You can't get a channel reviewed for monetization unless you hit 4,000 hours. I don't know why I have to do it again, but I do have to do it again. I have no choice on that. That is just the way it is. It's sad, man. It's sad that all my videos are now just gone. The worst thing about it was the reason why I had to delete those videos and not just hide them or Monet, like I could just switch off monetization on those videos but they said he has to delete them because we don't know if sometime in the future he'll re-monetize them yeah it was a bit of a kick in the nuts it's like where's the trust man just like if I say I'm not going to monetize a video in the future I'm not going to do it I'm not just going to be like hey, hey you re-monetize me I'm going to put all my video like I wouldn't do that but it's not good enough they said he has to delete them and that is that so they're all gone those videos are gone. My story on YouTube has been erased. It sucks. It really, really sucks, man. What I do want to say is thank you to everybody that's been here since the start, since the parkour days, since the climbing days. Thank you guys so much for, for being there throughout this part of my life. It has been insane. We've done some incredible things. Dude, I climbed the Eiffel Tower, man. Climbed the Eiffel Tower. What have we done? We've done Eiffel Tower. We've done Wembley Arch. Some of the tallest buildings in the world. It's just been absolutely incredible. And I honestly couldn't have done it without all of you. So yeah, I appreciate you all. Thank you for everybody that's bought merch, got my posters on the walls, wearing the t-shirts. It's just nuts. The amount of support that I've had over the years is just, I never, never imagined it. It's the end of an era, it really is. I've had so many amazing experiences, amazing opportunities, thanks to all the videos that I've done and thanks to thanks to you guys. So now you're probably wondering, okay, well what, now what? Are you done with YouTube? Are you not done with YouTube? Obviously I'm not done with YouTube. I wouldn't have fought so hard to get my channel back. If I was done with YouTube, I would have just left it and that would have been that. If you've been on my channel for a few years, you will remember my car and I know a lot of you love my car and i see a lot of you actually out when i'm driving people wave and they're like yes when i released that car video it must be three three and a half years ago now the response i got to it was so good so so good it really caught me by surprise i loved every second of making that video i loved being in the video and talking about my car I love being able to get my friggin beastie camera out and get my slider out and the gimbal like everything was so fun when i sat in front of that edit i was like yes i cannot wait to watch this footage i cannot wait to cut this video and it was just it was just so good and then i shot a video of my friend louis so he used to make videos on youtube reviewing cars life on unleaded if you've heard of it maybe i shot a video with him with our friends ferrari f12 beautiful white f12 i shot it i edited it and I just went full on with it. It was like my first proper project as like a cameraman, editor, whatever you'd want to call it. It was so fun. It was so friggin' fun. I was so proud of how it came out. I, I'll link to it up here. If you want to go watch it, check it out. I love that video. After that, I was like, I wish I could do more of these because I'd just gotten so bored of, of the climbing edits. It was so refreshing to have something that I was really passionate about. I love cars so much, man. I love sick cars. And to be able to film and edit and drive, like it's just, it's just perfect. And that is what I want to do now. I wake up in the morning and I, I just can't wait. Just can't wait to get up in the morning and drive my car and go out and take pictures of it or make a video on it and that's that's where my channel's going so from now on there will be car videos there will be car reviews there will be videos about my car the things i'm doing to it and i've got some amazing things lined up i've got some really cool cars lined up and i've got something that i can't tell you yet but it's pretty exciting if you're as hyped as i am for the car content make sure you're subscribed if you are subscribed make sure you click the little bell icon because now that's what you have to do on YouTube. Subscribing alone isn't enough apparently, so 
please click that bell icon and you will be notified when I upload a video. If you're not hyped for car videos, that's fine. Thank you again for your support thus far. It's been great. Things are changing a lot, man. Things are changing. I'm excited. I'm a little bit scared. I kind of get excited when I get scared. Oh, let's do it. Let's do it.